you subs if we subs we're subscribing to someone, it doesn't make sense. But trust me, YouTubers subscribe to others. In fact, I am pretty sure that Exploding TNT has at least subscribed to someone. 1.5.3 hotfix. This hotfix resolves several bugs as well as the, lo the lost inventory bugs. Some players may have lost their item inventories and character progress after updating to 1.5.0. To recover inventory that was lost, you'll need to have a Microsoft account or Nintendo account tied to that player when you last saw the player with its previous inventory. Without this, your data cannot be recovered. Do not uninstall or reinstall the game on the machine you last saw your old inventory on. This will destroy the cached data needed to recover your lost inventory. Merely updating the game should be fine. Log in to the same server, which has been upgraded to 1.5.3 from the same machine you last saw your old player inventory. Be sure to include B in an area which allows for chests to safely spawn. If you aren't, the game should inform you and try again for the next time you log into the game. Without the Microsoft account or Nintendo account, and the same device will, with the original data, the data cannot be recovered. If you see the full change log, you can see the full change log at aka.ms slash minecraft.update. Here are some of the other fixes to bugs that you reported to us on bugs.mojang.com. You can post your suggestions to the game at feedback.minecraft.net and discuss the update at discord.gg.minecraft. Xbox One Words Worlds, okay, blah, 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 blah. Okay, got it. Wait a minute. Okay, good. I, I still got my cape. And I got my custom skin. Okay. Again. We are going to be... Actually, we are going to do something new for a second. And we are going to go into our inside a block world. And we are going to see the blocks that ha we have see that we have made the insides of. And then afterward... We are going to play some more survival. It's going to be fun. Now I have to make this video like five minutes. I mean, I could make it like five minutes and I don't know how long I need to make my videos. Oh, don't think you could see a sneak peek. Okay, hello guys and welcome to Inside the Whoa. Ooh, it act the trident actually hit it. Think I'm done yet? Yeah. Nope. <laughs> Welcome to my inside a block world, which is in creative mode and for some reason on this world, I like to push drowns off the edge. You know why? Because it's a cool kid thing. Huh? Didn't take any damage. Dude! Take damage already! Thank you, drowned. Okay, now you may be wondering why I have all these sea lanterns in random places. Well, it's because of the build. The build that I used for this made it dark in some areas. It made like it made really dark areas and I had to fix that. So just get what you can. You don't feel like it, okay guys? And you will be just fine. And I got a broken trident, oh my goodness. Anyway, we are continue Netherrack. If you're looking at this and you're confused at what it is, it's a zombie pigment, okay? I know it doesn't look like a zombie pigment, because, well, zombie pigment heads aren't in Minecraft. Just deal with it. Yeet, yeet. This is kind of like a mini nether. 
that they had like wool blocks, mushroom blocks, terracotta, and then we have a structure block that has signs around it that say nether lobby. Press this button. Soul sand place. Wither skeleton. Of course, a wither skeleton friend meets, greets us. And sorry, guys. I really, really am sorry. But I cannot make this guy have all leather clothing. That I thought that made, earlier that made a noise. Um, glowstone. It's a whip. It's a work in progress, guys. Yes. The glowstone room is a work in progress. See, this is literally the frame for the glowstone room so far. Now we can go 